Michael Workshop is just going to show you how to use the combine feature. Um, so I'm just going to start a new part. So, okay. And to show you the combine feature, we, it's always about using two solid bodies. Um, so we're just going to sketch out two solid bodies real quick. So we go to our top plane, start sketch. We're just going to make rectangle like that uh, we'll give it a dimension of 50 by 50 and then press emboss in your features tab so let's make that 50 mil And now let's make a sketch on this face. Sketch. And we're going to use another rectangle. We're going to start the center point there. And I'm not going to give this a dimension. We're just going to emboss mid plane. So now it's halfway there, halfway there. So there's bodies interfering. Now this is really important. The merge results must be deselected for it to work. So let me show you if I didn't deselect it, when I come up here to see if I can use combine, it's grayed out. So you can't use it yet. So if you go to your boss extrude and just edit the feature, and then you deselect merge results, and now in my command search, I can see combine is. An option so real simple example here add subtract or common three different things add as you imagine might be um, it's adding both bodies to each other so they become one solid body whereas they're two solid bodies right now subtract is where you're going to select a body and you're going to subtract one from the other and common is where it's going to take the intersection of both of these solid bodies and it's going to save that area, that volume and it's going to remove everything outside where the two cubes interfere so let's just start with add one, two, select them both here you say OK now we know that worked because it's there's no solid bodies folder because there's only one solid body beforehand if I scroll this back that removes this temporarily the combined feature we can see there's two solid bodies A and B so let's go back to our combined feature now if we're going to do subtract we're going to set one as a main body so we're going to say this is the main body so, so select here this is the main body and now we're going to subtract this body from that body and that's what you get there and now common if we go back to our feature again and we edit feature we're going to say common and it's going to allow us to select both bodies this one's already and this one and there you have it just where the interfering section was now let's move on to a different example where you might use com combine. So let's say that you wanted to visualize an injection mold, the, the core steel for your injection mold. So uh, let's say, so I made half of the mold here, so it's just an emboss. So if I go to show, and that's just at the halfway point of this part, so it's the same either end. So if I just mirror this, this body, so I'm just going to use that face as the mirror line and body selected and there you go, so if I look at it in that way you can see it there so let's uh, let's see if we can use the combine so what we want to do is we want to visualize the mold so we want to subtract that part inside the two bodies from each other so <coughs> you would say here's the main body 
and the body that I want to subtract from this is going to, if you select your drop down menu, you can select it there. Sorry, that's the wrong one. It's this one here. And you can say, yep. Yeah. And what you'll see is uh, if I hide this with my tab key, you can see we've got that. Now, something that's important to mention, so Control Z just to show it again. Something that's important to mention about the combine feature is when you're subtracting a body from another body, you can't subtract this, this part body from both of these bodies at the same time. Because if I try to select this one, it just only selects this solid body rather than both. So I have to choose one or the other. I can't do it with multiple bodies. So in this scenario, all I really need to do is mirror that again. And we would get the form that we desired. So hopefully that was helpful to you guys. And please like and subscribe if you can. Any questions on the combined feature, you can get us in the comment section below. Cheers. Cheers.